Ooh, I'm very excited about this. For a long time, you've been able to do mail merge manually by clicking on the three dots and going mail merge. But there hasn't really been a good way to do it programmatically through Dilute Script until now. Because you previously, there were APIs to be able to do merging through Zoho Writer mail merge templates. But if you had a mail merge template in the CRM with CRM fields that you want to embed in, you couldn't really do that. But with version two of the APIs, Zoho has snuck in something that I've been asking for for a long time, which is the ability to get this list of templates, the mail merge templates, through Dilute Script. The way you do it is by using this settings API, going to templates, type equals mail merge, and you can choose the module. As long as that connection has access to the settings scope, you're able to get templates, which will look a bit like this. If we check out how they're structured, I'll show you that. So you can see we've got the name of the template, the module, and importantly, the resource ID. This is the critical part, because with this resource ID, we can then use it to communicate with the Zoho Writer API. You can see here in the next step, we're using the resource ID to get the fields for that particular template. And we can see that we're basically using the API names from the leads module, which is great because it means we don't really need to do anything else. We can, if we want to do a merge, we can just pass in the lead data using get record by ID. And then if we use merge and store to save it, to merge it and save it into work drive, it'll work. Let me show you one that I prepared earlier. And see, I mean, it's not a very impressive merge template, but we can see that we get the same result doing it this way as we do if we had manually clicked on merge, gone in and clicked a few buttons. So we've basically got first name, last name, email, phone. And if we were to do it normally, we would need to click a button to run the merge. take quite a long time. Whereas now, theoretically, we can have a workflow rule or a custom button that will do it in one step. And then, because you could theoretically take some action afterwards, is you will generate the PDF, save it in work drive, and theoretically, you could do other things after that. You could email the PDF, you could send out the PDF via a direct mail service. That's one thing I'm planning to do. Have a CRM extension to do that. Many opportunities. Yeah, you can see same result by manually merging it as I get by just running this code here. Just to prove that I didn't do it manually, let's have a look. I'll hit save and execute. And we should see that there'll be another one at 6.44 p.m. we go. This one here, these were the manual ones and this was the automated one. Still in progress, but very promising.